So I, hey, how's it going? It is um, March 8th and I am on my way to Denver at the moment um, in the Tesla and I am in traffic and this has been the best drive of my life. I have it on the autopilot and I'm on the I-25 coming up through Denver and it has just been absolutely fantastic fantastic um, you can see here I'm keeping one hand on the wheel of course but the car has been driving for the last I would say 15 minutes and it has been just absolutely fantastic I even got it to switch lanes once and it did everything um, with Denver traffic people cutting in and cutting out right now there's a truck <laughs> trying to pull in and it did its thing. It stopped, as you saw. And it alerted. There's a big accident up here. Or a truck. Something, something's off the road. I don't know. I can't, can't say it's an accident or not. But something's blocking the center lane. Um, and I got to say, the Tesla's been handling it very well. There we go. Denver police. Snowplow. Oh, it just looks like a truck. So now we should be speeding up in a little bit. See where it's gonna go, how it's gonna handle it. I decided to stay in traffic to see how it handled things instead of taking the HOV. Um, but it handled that traffic really well. I got about 18 miles left to my destination. So we'll see how we go. But this is, I gotta say, that was the best traffic jam I've been in. All right, see you in a minute. Well, hey, how is everybody? Um, I've had the Tesla for a week, and I am now out driving about. I'm actually taking my friend, picking my friend up from the doctor, and this snowstorm has blown in, and uh, I am just driving to the hospital to grab him. As you can see all around, it is almost a whiteout. Kind of crazy. Not happy with the windshield wipers, I have to admit. I don't know if you can see that, but that is really bad. Makes it harder to see. All right, I had to put the camera down <laughs> a little bit. I had to put the camera down there. But I don't know if you could see that on the windshield. It's like freezing up. Now, is that something that I've done? Because when I come down here to, no, sorry. When I come in here, I have the heated, I don't know, I think that's windshield wipers, I'm guessing. I have that on and I have the defrost on and I have the car set at 70. And as I'm driving, I mean, look at that. I don't know if you can see that. So that made it, and the windshield wipers just, I have them on auto. And you can see they're changing their speed. But if you look, they're, they just don't wipe efficiently. These are some of the worst windshield wipers I've had ever. <laughs> um, yeah, that'll make it difficult to drive. Um, as far as everything else, um, it handles great in the snow. I gotta say, it's good. I've been having a few, um, I don't know if it's software issues or what, the, the, with my phone, the car doesn't actually do anything but take phone calls uh, with the phone. So uh, I have a tech coming out on the 11th. So we will look at that then. I still love the car, I, you know, I expect some glitches and a learning curve, so I'm not really that pressed. But again, these windshield wipers, figured since I was driving out in this kind of snow, I'd let you see how they operate. Not the best windshield wipers. Um, yeah, if the snow were to get worse, I probably wouldn't be able to drive. But for right now, I think we're pretty good.